work that we've uh, just published takes a molecule that has been implicated in um, autism by virtue of some mutations found in patients with autism in these genes, um, the genes called neural ligands, and we've tried to understand how neural ligands normally function during the development of the nervous system. One of the hypotheses for how neurodevelopmental diseases like autism or perhaps even schizophrenia um, happen is by errors occurring during the formation of synapses. Now, the, the work in my lab and the, the work that we just published is trying to uncover how synapses form. And we think we've made one step towards understanding that. And But obviously this is not the cure for autism. It's just allowing us to understand what should be normally happening during the formation of synapses. What we've seen is that neural ligands um, are molecules that help bring other molecules that are absolutely required for a functional synapse to form. And so that would explain that if there are um, mutations in this neural ligand gene, it would prevent a synapse from forming fully functionally.